<clears throat> so basically what I was trying to get at earlier when this stream failed and my daughter woke up <clears throat> you alright? Um, socialism is a failure okay and from what I can tell I don't know why this I find, why this country what's that what's wrong well, what I find in this country is uh -oh. going uh -oh. hurt your knee. You hurt your knee? so this country goes to a uh, uh, it seemed me to lean toward socialism and communism for some reason which are both failed uh, uh, failed society states um, these ideas do not work uh, they may even work for a time but the problem with them is that you, when you take from the rich okay. and distribute now, it to the poor me, me, okay? um, all it does is create a power vacuum because someone was, must always wield some power, right? And every society tends toward, they, they have a little bit of a authoritarianism within them. Some are just less than others. And some have a, a balance. But with socialism, as in Venezuela, and I'm gonna use Venezuela because Venezuela is the one that uh, is, is most prevalent in the news. And if you, if you think about it, the mainstream media won't really report on Venezuela in a negative light because it sheds it sheds uh, well it, it shows that their ideas socialist ideas communist ideas don't work they never will work never have worked the reason why they don't work is that people need first of all to, to have a little bit of stress exerted on them to perform better. When people aren't allowed to become the best versions of themselves, they, they tend toward entropy, which means they implode. You have to be able to push yourself to your limits to become the best possible person that you can be. And capitalism does that. It's a flawed system. Uh, there's a lot of different things that can be changed but right now capitalism is the best thing that we have it's the best thing that allows people to live their best lives freely this is why we have not a democracy we have a republic this is people people kind of get that mixed up I mean People say that this is for democracy, but they forget we have a republic, not a democracy. All right, this is a constitutional republic. So well, the reason why I even went into this rant is because um, Uncharted 4, <laughs> Uncharted 4 puts you on this quest to find the pirate utopia. So in, in a pirate utopia, called Libertalia. All of these famous pirates, which I think some of them actually existed. Maybe all of them actually existed, but I, I do know that you can look them up. But they all came together and created this colony of pirates, a uh, socialist colony that, that we're, tra you know, we're traipsing around in and it shows pretty much that it imploded in some way. It failed. All right. It's showing that it failed. Um, because of whatever, I'm not really sure what happened, but it failed. And from what I can tell, all of these pirates hoarded their treasure together, and they used that treasure to build this society out in the middle of nowhere on this island all right so as we can tell it was it was it was vast uh, there's a lot of beauty to it a lot of culture to it it looks like um and in uncharted 4 
you really you don't get a huge idea of what's going on. Um, but to get the gist of it, that somebody, somebody wasn't happy with their piece of the pie. And that's what happens with socialism. It always ends in bloodshed, death. People end up dying, um, starving. Something always happens to, to put people in a position of where they lose their lives. All right, and it's crazy. It's it's usually crazy that people think socialism will get them anywhere. I'm sorry, it's always going to be poor people. People will always want for something. There will always be poor people. There will always be rich people. And it's because there isn't, people aren't equal. There's an imbalance in, in my state, imbalance in, um, people aren't, people aren't equally smart. What'd you say? Oh, a word? You got a, you got a poo poo? No. Uh. Oh yeah? I've been playing around in this game and just, just thinking about that, you know, logically, there had to be something to cause a society to implode. And, and what they allude to is that someone either came to this island looking for something, or somebody within the society caused it to implode. All right, somebody that was that was uh, a part of the society probably tried to take control because they weren't happy or satisfied with what they were getting, all right? You cannot equally divide anything among people. Um, it, it won't work because everybody, no, nobody views everybody as an equal. Eventually there will be somebody that says that I'm smarter than this person, so I deserve more. Or I'm stronger than this person, so I deserve more. Somebody always will be there to try to take power because they view something as being unjust to them. This is why socialism would never work, yeah. all right? So you need to get that idea out of your heads. Let it go, okay? Try something else. Think about making capitalism better or something. I don't know. But socialist societies always implode. They always end in bloodshed. They always end in some type of silly revolution where yeah. the power is just placed in another dictator's hands. That's all there is to it. Anyway, I'm out. I gotta go change the diaper or something. Oh, 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 oh,